Sensory memory is the shortest form of memory, holding information from the senses for a brief moment before it either fades or moves into short-term memory. It acts as a filter, allowing the brain to process large amounts of sensory input without becoming overwhelmed. Sensory memory is automatic and does not require conscious effort as it captures information from sight, sound, touch, taste and smell almost instantly. However, it lasts only a fraction of a second to a few seconds, making it a temporary storage system that helps with perception and quick decision making. A common example of sensory memory is the ability to briefly see an image after looking away. If someone glances at a bright light and then closes their eyes, they may still see the light for a moment due to visual sensory memory. Another example is when a person hears someone speak, but does not immediately register what was said. If they focus quickly, they can still recall the last few words because of auditory sensory memory. These examples show how sensory memory helps process information from the environment before it either disappears or moves into conscious awareness. One major strength of sensory memory is that it allows people to quickly take in large amounts of information without consciously thinking about it. This is essential for everyday tasks, such as recognising faces, following conversations, or reacting to sudden changes in the environment. Another strength is that sensory memory helps improve perception by providing the brain with a brief opportunity to organise and interpret sensory input before deciding what to focus on. Without sensory memory, processing information would be much slower and less efficient. Despite its benefits, sensory memory has limitations. One major weakness is its extremely short duration. Most sensory impressions last only a fraction of a second before they fade, meaning that important information can be lost if not quickly transferred to short-term memory. Another weakness is that sensory memory is easily disrupted by distractions. For example, if a person is focusing on one conversation in a noisy room, their sensory memory of other voices quickly disappears. This makes it difficult to retain fleeting sensory details unless they receive further attention. An alternative to sensory memory is working memory, which allows for the active processing and temporary storage of information for a slightly longer period. While sensory memory holds raw sensory input for a brief moment, working memory actively manipulates and organises information for problem solving, reasoning and learning. For example, when solving a math problem, working memory helps keep numbers in mind while performing calculations. Unlike sensory memory, which is automatic and unconscious, working memory requires effort and attention, making it more useful for complex cognitive tasks.